Leah, a disappointing result. What, what's your thought of the game? I thought it was um, a close encounter, wasn't it? Um, not many opportunities in the game. Uh, you know, we're, we're disappointed, uh, obviously. Um, I don't think we really got going as a, as a, as a forward entity in the, in the game. There was you know, a little bit at the beginning and a little bit right at the end, but it was that kind of, uh, you know, kind of uh, closer contained game. Because the first first 15 minutes, games came out of the traps and the forward play was there. What, why did that lack later on? Do you feel? <sighs> Decision making, isn't it? That we uh, we stopped doing, you know, what we're capable of. We just had a good chat about things, uh, you know, just that subject uh, in the dressing room afterwards as well. And uh, you know, we have to make sure that uh, you know we're moving the ball around the, the park, pass it, passing the ball. I think everything got a little bit um, nervy and jumpy, and there wasn't any continuity to our play. Hence, uh, you know, you, you, you're not going to create as many opportunities as you want to. What, what caused the, the nervy and jumpiness? Do you feel? Good question. I mean, you do get games like that, but you, you, you've got to instill, uh, you know, the style of play that you want to do in the game, and not not let it pass you by. And I thought the game kind of passed us by in a little bit, where you know neither neither side was having a, a massive effect. Uh, you know, I've asked. Uh, I mean, I thought young Marcus did extremely well on his uh, on his on his debut, but. You know, how many saves has he had to make? Uh, was the one. Yeah, that's, that's what Marcus said as well. The same as as, as Tommy in, in, in the uh, in the other goal as well. But that the thing that uh, you know concerned me is that we weren't getting the ball down and, and, and passing it and, and, and probing. It was just you know it was just um, disjointed if I probably term it. Is that is that something you're going to work on this week? Oh, of course, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, sometimes you get those in the season. You know, you let, you, let, you might have a game or two where you know the, the, the games are a little, a little bit off, but you know we have to remember that. Um, you know, it's been two demanding fixtures by two clubs that I believe are going to be up there at the top. Uh, you know, uh, at the end of the season, and we've got to learn our lessons. I mean, the seasons are you know it's a long. We'll have South Shields back down here, and we'll have to go to Scarborough. You know, we have to we have to learn those lessons of. Uh, you know, our, 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 uh, you know, we, we didn't play the, the, the game plan that uh, you know that we should be doing. And considering Scarborough at top, you, you certainly stopped them playing as well, though, didn't you? Well, for me, it, it resembled a little bit of the game on Saturday as well. You know, it's, you know, either goalkeeper on Saturday hardly had anything to do. Hardly goalkeeper tonight hardly had anything to do. It was a bit of a, a cancelling out, wasn't it, in, in in between the two boxes? But you know, uh, when, when things are, are moving in your direction, you know, it's. Uh, it's a good header, isn't it? But he shouldn't be allowed a free header, you know. And it's it's looped over Marcus. Marcus, he's, you know, he's no chance with that the way it's uh, looped over him. So you know, he was disappointed. Uh, and yeah, we pushed a little bit, didn't we? Right at the end, but uh, you know, the forward play needs to improve. And when you say forward play or defensive play, you always, people may think, oh, you're just talking about the defence or talking about the, uh, uh, you know, about the forwards. But no, you're talking about the team as an entity. And uh, you know. You all defend as a team, you all attack as a team. Now, if the service up to the front is not good enough, well, that has to be examined. If the service is good up to the front and it's not been looked after properly, well, that has to be examined. So, you know, those are the things that we'll have to look at and improve on. But saying that, you know, they've done it already this season. You know, so, uh, you know, it's, it's within them, yeah. How do you feel Johnny Margaret's did? Yeah, yeah, showed uh, some lively touches early on. So, you know, it's, it's all new for him, isn't it? I know he's been here before, but it's a different, uh, different set of players. So, uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, he's, he'll be good to, uh, you know, I think it's about 70 minutes, wasn't it? And on Saturday, it turns to FA Trophy. Does that, does that come at a good time, do you think? Maybe so, maybe so for us this time. I mean, uh, I think with the, the FA Cup win, it didn't come at a good time because you got the, yeah, but, uh, you know, after two defeats, two very, very close defeats as well, uh, uh, might be a good idea just to, uh, you know, dip into uh, the FA Trophy just to, uh, you know, Give us a different uh, perspective, you know, just uh, just for a few days, you know, and then, and then obviously, you, you know, come back strong to the uh, league campaign. And the atmosphere here tonight, I know there was a big away following, but mm. the home support was really loud and boisterous as well. It was a great atmosphere. Yeah, yeah, obviously, you know, they've, uh, I wish we could have put on, uh, you know, a better performance for them and obviously uh, you know, a better result. But uh, yeah, we're, uh, you know, we're very grateful of, uh, you know, the vocal support and, uh, you know, it was, it was a good crowd this evening. Okay, thank you. Good time. Cheers.